Welcome to the homework for lesson 19. It's module 5 of grade 2. Please write your name here first. And we're just doing some solving and explaining. Uh, some of this is, is this going to be all addition? No, there's some addition and there's some subtraction. So just try and think of all the different strategies we have and which ones are going to be the best. I mean, I may choose different ones than you would choose. So you'll have different, you may ha have different uh, choices for strategy and you might have different explanations for strategy. Um, so, and, and they can all be correct. So if I'm looking at 200, 340 plus 250, um, I don't see an easy way to make 10 there. So I'm just going to add this up, air away. I can add the hundreds first. And I could have just as easily done this vertically too. And now I add the 50. And this is an easy two-step arrow away process because I don't have to compose 100 when I add the 10s. 590. Arrow away is two steps, two easy steps. without composing tens or ones. Four hundred ninety plus three hundred fifty. Well, that four hundred ninety is almost five hundred. So I'm thinking of a little number bond strategy here, where I could take ten out from that three hundred fifty, and then three hundred forty is ten less, and that's going to make five hundred. And that's easy mental math here, eight hundred forty. My explanation is 490 is almost 500. So taking 10 from 350 makes easy mental math. numbers. And maybe you have a better way to say it than that. If you could have chose the same strategy, you might have a better way to say it that is a lot easier to say. Um, 519 plus 342. I don't see an easy way to make 10 with any of those digits and none of them are None of them look really close to anything that's going to be useful to do mentally. So I don't see an easy mental shortcut for these. So I'm just going to add them vertically. You know, I could use an HDO chart for this also. If that's what I wanted to do. Uh, to, yeah, because you're going to compose. Uh, yeah, 9, nine plus 2 is 11. And four and two ones is six. And then five plus three is eight for our hundreds. Explanation, uh, I like the vertical way. Is easier than drawing chips. Let's see, 610 plus something is 784. Uh, we could just count this up the arrow way. That's, the, that's one of the easiest ways to do a missing add-in problem. 
when you're missing one of the add-ins, you know what you need to get for these digits here. And I know some second graders will actually do this vertically instead of the arrow way. And they'll look at it, uh, they'll set up the add-ins and write the total first and then figure out what the add-in has to be digit by digit and do it that way. Um, I'm just going to add it up using the arrow way. Uh, I know I need to get 700, so I'm going to add 100. 710. And I need to get to 84, so I need 70 more to get 780. And then I need four more from there. And here's what I needed to add, 174. Oops. Uh, arrow way. Took only three steps to count up. One step for each place value. All right, now we're looking at subtraction. And, oh, we could use that compensation strategy we used, um, uh, or simplification strategy is what we called it, right? If we subtract one from both of these, from the minuend and the subtrahend, we'll get really easy vertical numbers. So that will make uh, and 456 minus 1 is 450. And you don't have to write it out exactly the way I am. The way I'm doing it. 9 minus 5 is 4. 9 minus 5 is 4. 6 minus 4 is 2. And I did this because... Subtracting 1 from... from menu end leaves 699 nines are beautiful when you do this because when you do a vertical method you're never going to have to unbundle something to uh, to get more in a place value with when you already have nine there because you can only subtract nine for one digit so leave 699 so no No decomposing tens or ones. And we have another subtraction one where we have 904 minus 395. This 395 is almost 400. So we just add 5 to both. We have 909 minus 400. 509 and we'll draw our little tape diagram that's our difference this was our menu end small piece of tape smaller number which is our subtrahend and we added five to both both minuend and and 
subtrahend makes easy mental math numbers.